Hey everybody, John from the Rusty Chains here today, and we're going to be talking about all the new crazy changes to Torbjorn and his abilities on the Overwatch PTR. Let's dive right in. Torbjorn's weapon, the Rivet Gun, has been buffed a bit. The primary fire speed has been increased from 60 to 70. The reload time has been reduced from 2.2 seconds to 2 seconds even. The secondary fire, the shotgun, has also received a number of changes. The recovery time between shots has been lowered from 0.8 seconds to 0.6. The total damage is down from 150 to 125, but the reload time is again reduced from 2.2 to 2 seconds, and spread and random weapon is reduced by 50%. So although there's slightly less damage, you can fire faster and more accurately with Torp's shotgun. Armor packs are a thing of the past. Torb's Hellspawn is the only thing in the game that can still provide armor to other heroes now. Torb's E ability is now Overload. It gives him 150 temporary armor, as well as allowing him to move, attack, and reload 30% faster. It has a 5 second duration for a 12 second cooldown. Torbjorn's turret is now a thrown projectile. It has half the cooldown reset when you deploy it, and a full cooldown begins when the turret is destroyed. A new turret cannot be placed if the existing one has taken damage or dealt it within the last 3 seconds. The turret can be manually destroyed by Torbjorn. It no longer explodes if Torb dies while it is still building. That's huge. Turret levels have been removed, the turret automatically builds up to level 2 over 3 seconds and deals the same amount of damage as the previous level 2 turrets. It has 250 health. Now here's the big thing. Torb has a small degree of control over the turrets. By shooting at enemies with Torb's left click, that will direct the turret to focus on the enemies he's damaged if the turret has line of sight. Torbjorn's new ultimate, Molten Core, is an area denial tactic. It allows him, over the course of 6 seconds, to shoot 10 balls of Molten Lava that spawn a damage pool where they land. They do 130 damage over their duration unless your target is armored. Then they do additional damage and burn through it 190. So there you have it, all the changes coming to Torbjorn on the Overwatch PTR. What do you think? Let us know below. Until next time, don't forget to spread the happy and stay rusty. Torbjorn's deployable turrets have received... I tried to say three. It was supposed to be four.